analysis videos with me, which Paramark analyst at Antic Markets on Thursday, 25th of January. Uh, looking at cable now, and um, what a strong move we've seen in cable in the last couple of weeks. Massively burning higher. The uh, breakout above 140 didn't stop. The breakout above 142 didn't stop. 143.30, basically today's high. The market consolidating a touch, but still forming a bull candle. Um, and uh, the breakout on sterling continues. Now, you're looking at this move and you think, well, is this going to stop? Well, there's nothing really to stop cable because it's sort of trading now within this sort of big vacuum of selling pressure it got in the wake of Brexit. And you could argue, what's the next resistance? Well, is it not up towards sort of these highs? 47.80 area, 47.70. It's... It's difficult to really say. I mean, you're through the 76.4% fib level now of the of the move, so it really is um, sort of continuing and uh, moving higher. There's nothing really to stop further gains in sterling. You might see a bit of dollar strengthening. Say, for example, if the EC if the market reacted euro negative to the ECB today, a uh, bit of jaw burning maybe from Draghi, you could see dollar strengthening, and that would be sort of a move that does start to sort of usher in a bit of a dollar correction. Sorry, a dollar rally, and uh, that's probably what's going to put pay to this sterling uh, dollar rally uh, on cable. But even then, you're sort of looking at what sort of retracements we're going. Well, you've got the RSI at 84. I mean, that is huge on sterling. You never, never really get the market up that sort of high. 2000. I mean, even then, 82. 2013. Should we go back further than that? What are we looking at? Oh, come on. No, don't want to help. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, you're looking at levels un almost unprecedented uh, in terms of how strong this move is. And the uh, MACD lines are very strong as well, accelerating higher. But it is almost going exponential, or certainly did yesterday. And um, you sort of stretched on the, on the Bollinger Bands um, and really are stretched on the price. So it's... It is due a retracement. It just depends on as to when it happens and uh, how far the run higher goes before you get that retracement. And therein lies the issue. Um, but uh, yeah, a retracement is is likely at some stage. It's probably going to bring you back to 140. But uh, is it going to happen sort of in, in today? Is it going to happen tomorrow? It's very difficult to say. I think the ECB could have a, a say in that move. But um, for now, you're holding up. You've got initial support. Today's low, 42.15, uh, sorry, 42.15, I think it is, is today's low, but uh, 42.80, 41.85 as well. But uh, yeah, still going on on cable. So I wish you good luck in your trading. I'll speak to you later.